Hey guys, Sam here today, and I'm going to be filming a video about all things birthday party. So, I'm going to show you what I'm doing for my birthday party, and tell you how I plan it out, and some game ideas included in that. So, the first thing I make is a schedule on Word. I'm pretty nerdy and pretty organized, and I want my birthday to be perfect, so I kind of plan it out. Um, but I didn't plan it out as much as I normally do this year. It might seem like a lot to you, though. So my friends will get here at 2, and then from 2 to 5 we're going to just play games, um, do like different challenges and being boozled and like a little photo shoot. And then at 5 o'clock we're going to dinner, and then after that we're going to go see Insurgent. It comes out today, and I was really excited it came out the day before my real birthday because it's perfect to go to the movies for my birthday. It's really fun. And hopefully, I think some of my friends are going to bring candy from the Dollar Tree so that we have candy and stuff. And then we're going to come home after the movie, which ends around like 9 o'clock. And we're going to have ice cream, and then we're going to sleep in the living room. And if we didn't already do the bean boozled, we'll do it de then. And then Bravo Burger for breakfast. So, games is charades, like celebrity charades or regular charades. Um, I'm going to do like two truths and a lie, but with um, like playing cards. So there's a 10, a 10, and an ace, and then whoever gets the ace is the liar, and when I ask a question, they have to lie about their answer. Um, who knows Sam the best? I made a quiz, and so there's three copies of that for my friends, and when they do it, they can't see me, because they'll like see my eye color and guess my height and all that, and then I have to take their phone so they can't search anything. So this is the answer key. It just like has all the answers, like in a paragraph form. Um, pretty simple. That's a pretty, I do that, I've done that like two or three times throughout the years. I just, I don't know, I really like doing that. A good time killer too. Um, after, what's the next game? Oh, um, Bean Boozled. So, I went to Fuzzy Wigs Candy Store and I got the Bean Boozled Challenge with like the spinner and it comes with like 70, almost like 100 jelly beans in here. So I'm really excited for that because it has um, like 20 flavors and I get to do it with my friends and then there's enough for me to do it with my family too. And I really want to get my uh, little three-year-old brother to do them. We'll see what he thinks of the flavors. Um, another thing is like appropriate truth or dare. There's still like funny ones in here. But I just printed out like I went on a website and searched uh, appropriate or clean truth or dares. And then read through them if I liked them. I copied and pasted them onto Word and printed them out and then used a paper cutter. Folded them up and put them in here. It's pretty simple. You don't even have to do it like that specific. You could just go on the internet and just start calling them out. Um, but I put them truth and dare in containers. And then in this container has all of our initials. So then when we need to choose a partner for any partner game, we just grab it out of there. Um, what's in my mouth challenge? Like one person is blindfolded and you have to feed them gross stuff. Um, guess the lyrics. My sister, um, like made a document of different lyrics and song names and whatever. And it's like the answer key and then she'll say the lyrics and we have to try to guess what song it is. Toilet paper fashion show. So you can check out my video for like having a cheap birthday party. I'll link it down below. Because I go to the Dollar Tree for like 50% of my birthday events. Like... I got prizes for all the games, so I got like a really good pigmented lipstick, lip gloss, fake nails, and a one joking prize that's like this um, window clean. And then, and then also I forgot to add that at Fuzzy Wigs I got these larvae um, worm things, and we have to try to eat those as well. That's pretty much it, I guess, for the schedule part of it. Um, hmm. Oh, we're going like in the hot tub after the movie, like I said, and we're going to have ice cream in the hot tub. And yeah, I'm really excited for that because I don't, I love Costco cake, but ice cream is my favorite dessert. So I get to like celebrate that, you know, because it's my birthday. Everyone's going to eat what I like. So I'm pretty excited. Hopefully this gave you some good ideas. If you're like me, you don't want to have all those dirty games like spin the bottle and stuff, but you still want to have fun and you don't want it to be a lame party. And I'm really excited because we have like three hours to kill at like two o'clock so I can like try to, we might just make our own games and not do these. I'm just really excited to see how everything goes and we have the sleepover tonight so I'm really excited for that. And um, that's pretty much it I think. I'm going to go film a get ready with me for 
on my birthday party, like birthday edition. So make sure to check that down below in the links. And thank you for watching. Hopefully this gave you some inspiration. And make sure to comment down below if you have any video requests or anything like that. And make sure to subscribe for more from me, Versatile Sam. I'm going Bye. to be telling you all about why and how much I love the Dollar Tree. Because number one, they have tons of DIY stuff. For example, they have mason jars. So you can do the glow-in-the-dark mason jars. You can buy ingredients to make slime. You can make like makeup containers. My sister just did that. She found some pebbles, some stickers, some bases, and she glued it all together and put it together, and that's her makeup brush holder. Um, they have tons of cool containers. They're great for office supplies. They have school supplies. So that's like number two is that they have good supplies, like just everyday things like, like I said, school supplies, cleaning, food, candy showering supplies and some of their stuff is actually like name brand like Suave and stuff and they have tons of toothpaste and toothbrushes and they even have like a medicine section like a vitamin section of course it's always risky you know to buy like things like that from the Dollar Tree but if you're really having a hard time with money seriously try it out because it might work for you also they have like candles and you can make a lot of DIYs with what they have there um, they also have like a seasonal section most of the time, like Easter, Christmas, Halloween, Valentine's Day. And that's really great because you can get all your Easter eggs there and Easter candy or whatever. And then my favorite is the movie candy section or just candy section. They have two whole aisles at mine and they have so much variety. Like I could probably spend half an hour there just trying to pick out movie candy and I it could be a really, number four is that it could be a really, really great place for birthday um, supplies and everything because they have balloons, like good balloons, like the shiny ones. They have rubber balloons that you can blow up. They have a whole birthday bag section and all that. And you can just take your friends there and give them $10 each and then they could go spend it for how, find any stuff and you guys can all play with it and eat it at home. Um, you can give each person $5 to choose out the movie candy, go see a movie, sneak in the candy, and you just saved a lot of money because the movies can be pretty expensive and if you take out that one big cost then it's going to be a lot more freeing to go to the movies because you're not going to worry about all the money things. That's why I love the Dollar Tree. I am not misfortunate with money but I'm willing to save it because I am going to college in a few years and I want to have a car so I gotta start saving up for that but I also want to get gifts for people and you can actually get heartfelt gifts there. You can make things. That's what I love personally. I love when someone gives me a basket of stuff or makes me something because it's heartfelt and I know they didn't go out of their way trying to spend a million dollars on me. One example of something I made for my cousin's birthday coming up is this movie candy basket. And this is completely DIY, let me show you. So these are his favorite candy boxes things. And then I just hot glued everything, a piece of cardboard on the bottom. And then I got some other candies in here. I really think you'll enjoy it. And I feel like I did my part to sell, give him something for his birthday, not just leave him hanging. But this is only $8. And I love, like, just DIY things. Like, one of my friends made me the coconut crayon lip glosses, and she got containers from there, and pretty much did it all from there. And, yeah, I just love that place for gifts, um, supplies, birthdays, and um, DIYs. So hopefully you guys will check it out because I really do think it's great for people who are having money problems because they have your everyday things. But also for anyone who wants to have a birthday on the cheap or give someone a gift on the cheap because it's so perfect for anyone like that because it's, it's just so fun. Like, I could spend hours there, and I do. And I also want to just add real fast that I got some gifts from my other cousins. And I just want to show you some of the other things they have. They have a whole hair section. Like you can get 75 bobby pins for a dollar. So I got that for my mom. And then I got some headbands and little wrist uh, Easter colored ones for my cousin. And then they have a lot of joking stuff too. So like um, we, I got this window cling for like April Fool's. And then like these funny Easter bunny glasses. And they also have regular sunglasses too. And if I didn't already say, they have a huge makeup section. I got all the prizes for all the games for my birthday from the makeup section. And then I also got like these cups for anyone of my cousins who wants it. 
So yeah, and I also got this acne treatment roll-on thing, and I'm going to test this out. And I get stuff for myself all the time. I love their makeup. I love the movie candy, like I said. I could just keep repeating myself for hours because I just love the Dollar Tree so much. And hopefully this will remind you that if you have a Dollar Tree near you or any store like that, you will go there instead of spending a few dollars more somewhere else because after a while it will all start to add up to a lot cheaper than what you're spending now on your everyday things and gifts and all these things especially in March there's a lot of March birthdays and yeah so hopefully you guys enjoyed I really do think it, you guys could have a whole birthday using only things from the Dollar Tree and yeah hopefully you will go there and check it out and hopefully you like this video just so you guys know I'm not sponsored I just love the Dollar Tree and I want to share with the world that you guys should go there and make sure to subscribe and comment as well. Bye!